Chapter Nine. My Fun Day. Abu, what day is it today? It's Saturday. How do you know that? Because yesterday was Friday. Then what is tomorrow? <laughs> Let's watch this video to learn the days of the week. So if you look here, you'll see a chart of the days of the week. So here we have Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, Saturday, and Sunday. Monday is known to be the first day of the week. Now, which do you think is the third day of the week? Monday is the first. The second day of the week is Tuesday. On the third space, you see Wednesday. So Wednesday is the third day of the week. Now, what is the last day of the week? If you look down this chart, you'll see the last day here, which is number seven, is Sunday. Now, which is the fifth day of the week? Let's go to number five here. So we see that Friday is the fifth day of the week. Which day comes after Tuesday? If we look over here, Wednesday comes after Tuesday. Which day comes before Sunday? We'll see the day before Sunday is Saturday. Now, what day comes after Sunday? This one's a little tricky. After Sunday, you go all the way back to Monday. Let's see what's three days after Tuesday. So we know after Tuesday, we've got Wednesday here. Then we have Thursday. The third day after Tuesday is Friday. Let's see what's three days before Monday. This again is kind of tricky. You need to go all the way back down this way, and we'll count upwards. That's one, two, and three. So we know Friday is three days before Monday. So what's seven days after Monday? So we have Monday here. So that's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. So after Sunday, we know we get Monday. So seven days after Monday is Monday. What is the day today? Let's say it's Monday. Which day was it yesterday? Now, yesterday means the day before. So, if today is Monday, the day before Monday, as you can see on the chart, is Sunday. Now, which day will it be tomorrow? Tomorrow is the next day. If today is Monday, tomorrow would be Tuesday. Now, which day will it be day after tomorrow? Now we know tomorrow is Tuesday, so the day, so the next day after Tuesday would be Wednesday. Which day was it day before yesterday? Now we know yesterday was Sunday, so the day before Sunday is Saturday. So we know the day before yesterday is Saturday. Let's do a fun activity on the days of the week. Priya. Likes to watch these channels on different days of the week. Now let's see which channel does Priya watch on the day after Tuesday. So we know the day after Tuesday is the next day, so that's Wednesday. So she watches Animal Planet on Wednesday. Now what does Priya watch on the day before Saturday? So here's Saturday. We know the day before Saturday is Friday. So Priya. Watches National Geographic on the day before Saturday, which is also known as yesterday. Priya likes to watch Pogo on the day before. Let's see if you can figure this one out. So we can see Pogo here is on a Tuesday. So Priya likes to watch Pogo on the day before Wednesday, which is Tuesday. Now, what does she enjoy watching on Saturday and Sunday? This is Saturday. She likes to watch Cartoon Network, and on Sunday, she also likes to watch Cartoon Network. It's a lot of cartoons. Months of the year. Now let's move on to the months of the year. Let's look at this chart and see the order of the months. 
So we have the first month, January, February, March, April, May, June, July, August, September, October, November, and December. Now, which is the first month of the year? If we look at the chart, we'll see that the first month here is January. So January is the first month of the year. Now, which is the fourth month of the year? So as you can see on the chart, number four here is the fourth month of the year, which is April. Which month comes after June? Let's find June here on the chart. If you look at the number six, you'll see June. So the month after June is July. Which month comes before October? If you go to the chart and you go to number 10, which is October, and the month before that, you'll see is September. Which is the last month of the year? If you go to the end of the chart, which is number 12, you'll see that December is the last month of the year. Some months have more days. Now let's see how many days does each month have. 